The North Face 2014 Endurance Challenge Series kicked off on May 3rd and 4th at Bear Mountain State Park in New York. The two-day running event and festival started early Saturday morning with the challenging Gore-Tex 50-mile trail race. Loose rocks, tree roots, and technical ups and downs marked the course. Though warm and dry on race day, earlier rains left large pockets of mud that added to an already challenging venue. I've probably done close to 20, 50 milers at this point in my career, and I think that was probably the toughest one I've ever done. It was really wet, really technical. The conditions made for an exciting but difficult and relatively slow race. National and regional elites had to work hard to find a rhythm and establish a pace. There wasn't a ton of climbing, but it still felt like you were pretty tired at the end just because of how technical it was. But for a lot of part of that course, I mean, you were like running through streams, you were you just couldn't really get like a fast pace going. In the men's race, Jordan McDougall was a clear favorite going in. He has owned the race, taking the top spot in each of the past three years. Mike Wolf, who's no stranger to the podium, was another favorite in the men's field. But Dylan Bowman was right there with them from the start. A little over halfway through the race, it became clear. Bowman was the one to watch. Around the 30 mile mark or thereabouts, I could just sort of feel that um, they were fading ever so slightly and I happened to be feeling pretty good and I got a tiny bit of separation and uh, figured I might as well just hit the gas a little bit. Bowman held strong to cross the finish line first, beating McDougal by nearly 15 minutes. McDougal finished second and Wolf took third. North Face athlete Rory Bozio took control of the women's race right from the start. Bozio bested second place finisher Helene Michaud by 53 minutes and crossed a full hour 14 ahead of Rachel Paquette, who finished third. Bozio's been racing ultras since 2007, but her breakthrough came last August when she smashed the women's course record at UTMB. Though considered best at longer distances, her decisive win at Bear Mountain has people wondering, will Bozio be looking for other technical 50s this season? I found that the course was pretty fun, and since it was so different to what I'm used to running, it kind of seemed like the day went by pretty fast. Podium or not, finishers could look forward to a warm greeting and a cold beer. The North Face always puts on awesome races, and they're almost always really competitive, and, you know, there's prize money, and, you know, they're going to be marked well and have a good, you know, finish line atmosphere and a good party. Finish line festivities at ECS are part of what makes this series a favorite among trail runners. <laughs>